My name is Salvador Abrams. I'm an emergency physician. Um, uh, went to school in Mexico City and did my residency in the Chicago area. And I worked uh, there in the Chicago area for about 15 years before moving to Texas. Uh, I've been with HPP since the very beginning, uh, in 2001, when, when HPP was called ED Care. And I've grown with them along the way until now. Uh, currently, um, I am the Vice President of Medical Affairs or Clinical Operations for some of the hospitals in the Texas market and also the Medical Director for uh, the Emergency Room at Southwest General in San Antonio. We can start by uh, looking at Southwest General in San Antonio. Uh, it's a hospital with about 300 beds. Uh, the ER right now uh, about 40,000, no more, 45, 48,000 visits a year. Uh, it's a challenging place because the uh, hospital is in a uh, area of the city that is in a kind of a mid-low socioeconomical area. So the type of patients that you get are patients that are sick, uh, that don't take care of themselves for one or another reason. And is it, so it, it becomes a challenging place. It really challenges you and your skills, uh, not only as a physician, but as a manager and try to keep the flow going. The hospital administration is very supportive of the medical staff or the emergency department. Uh, and it's a nice place to work. Texan Hospital is the opposite from Southwest General. It's a, a very low volume uh, ER. Um, that uh, right now they're seeing maybe 15 patients in 24 hours. The typical physician that we find there is, you know, the physician who's probably uh, in the last stages of their career, that they don't want to work very hard, that they don't mind to work the 24-hour shifts. And it's a very nice place to work also. It's a small ER, only five rooms, five-bed ER. Uh, but again, the census is only 10 or 15 patients a day. Um, the nursing staff uh, works very well with the doctors and um, it, it nice, it's a nice place.